CBS 2 News starts right now with breaking news. Breaking charges tonight in the murder of a UIC student, Ruth George, as police reveal her final moments. Good evening. I'm Erica Sargent. And I'm Brad Edwards. This man, a felon with a violent past, charged tonight. Let's get right to Charlie DeMar on the UIC campus. Charlie. Brad and Erica, we do know that Donald Thurman was out on parole after serving just two years of a six year sentence for armed robbery. As for this case, UIC police say that Thurman confessed to killing UIC student Ruth George. He is now charged with aggravated uh, sexual assault and first degree murder. UIC police say Donald Thurman followed sophomore Ruth George into this campus parking garage on Halstead near Taylor at 1:34 Saturday morning. Thurman right behind her enters the garage at 1:35. Just a minute later, Thurman left the garage at 2:10 a.m. And in that time, 35 minutes, he's accused of sexually assaulting and murdering the 19-year-old student. The kinesiology major was reported missing by her family. Her phone traced to the parking lot where she was found strangled in the back seat. The FBI helped campus police review surveillance video, picking up on Thurman's patterns. He's a regular on the Holstead Street Blue Line, and that's where Thurman was arrested Sunday morning, roughly 24 hours after police say he killed George. Thurman was out on parole, released from prison in 2018, sentenced to six years for armed robbery, but he only served two. Tonight, at least 200 UIC students returned to the parking garage, lit candles, laid flowers, and said goodbye. Now, Thurman's last known address is near the campus, but UIC police say that he has no connection to the university and had no relationship with George. Previously, Thurman will make his first court appearance tomorrow. We'll be there, too. Live from UIC's campus, Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. Erica. All right, Charlie, thank you.